Welcome back to our channel, the channel for the latest news and untold stories about Princess of Wales, Princess Catherine, and her royal family. Today, we bring you breaking news. Princess Catherine is radiant in the biggest camouflage coat and cozy snow boots on their visit to the Irish Guards. To attend the Irish Guards, Catherine dressed warmly throughout the largest camouflage coat as well as her cozy winter boots. Catherine could be something of a lady of habit when related to her appearance, are seeing the multiple Alexander McQueen jackets and T-length outfits. However, when performing one amongst her busier royal tasks, she suddenly adopts a completely different look. The Princess of Wales chose to dress warmly in camouflage on Wednesday as she visited the Irish Guards during a wintry day of drills in medieval England. Catherine donned an enormous dark-colored camo coat over a gray cardigan sweater, along with corresponding olive green leggings, black gloves, as well as a gray beanie. Guard soldiers wore heavy camo outfits to be warm. Even though she stood in now and where to assist a war victim, the erstwhile princess took her brown hair back into its neat French braid to protect it off of her face. Her soul jewelry was a pair of small gold hoops. Catherine's attendance was the initial time she had been to the regiment ever since she was appointed its ceremonial captain upon the passing of Queen Elizabeth II in September 2022. Already, when his father, King Charles III, named William the Colonel of the Welsh Guards to correspond with his different title as the Prince of Wales, Prince William held that position. Catherine first met the soldiers number one and number two battalion of the Irish Guards at Wiltshire Plain to learn regarding their previous assignments to East Africa. She then accompanied soldiers number three battalion while they participated in some clinical training missions. The British monarchy posted a photo of the wintry early hours on Salisbury Plain when the Irish Guards were combined Instagram profile. The mission of said Irish Guards seemed to be as diverse as it was exceptional, extending from demining instructions to Ukrainian armed services to educating security officers in East Africa on neutralizing. Wonderful to have been with the mix today and witnessed their dedication in any condition. Catherine reportedly accompanied Prince William when he greeted Norway's future king Harkon and future queen Mette Marit to castles this past weekend. This was their initial formal encounter since about the Wales' 2018 journey to Oslo. Catherine dressed appropriately for something like this event, with a sharp olive green jacket and complimenting ruffled pants. She donned a customary Burberry pussy bar blouse just below the outerwear. Mette Marit, meantime, donned a vivid red midi dress, featuring delicate cap sleeves and dark brown heels. The two successors coordinated in dark blue suits, including Harkin sporting a blue tie, as well as William wearing a red tie. The goal of the previous conversation would have been to discuss green power options with leaders from prominent Norwegian corporations, notably Bree Jacobsen, general manager of Northern Lights JV. Irvind Eriksson, CEO of Aka ASA, as well as Alex Grant, Chief Executive Officer of the UK National Administration for Equinor, Vega Christiansen Sturman, and Norwegian envoy for the United Kingdom, reportedly attended the conference with them. William and Catherine have experienced a busy week of activities thus far. The pair joined in a St. David's Day procession and went to the Wales Air Ambulance Centre and watched the Wales vs England Six Nations football match. William had been named the official sponsor of the Wales Air Ambulance Organisation this past week. Since being granted the rank of Prince of Wales, this represents his initial sponsorship. The Prince had first been worked in a distinctive and frequently difficult rescue helicopter atmosphere, according to Sue Barnes, Chief Executive of the Wales Air Ambulance Organisation. As with all charitable organisations, they keep assisting potentially life-saving aid to the citizens of Wales. We look forward to seeing our connection established well with the Prince. Thank you very much for watching today's video. What do you think she looks like in a soldier suit? Please share your ideas with us, and for now, I bid you farewell.